What is up guys, this is Morton Power 35 here and today what I got for you guys is a video on the Type 2 Butcher. This is the epic variant of the Type 2 which fires as a Kimbo shotgun, which if I'm going to equate it to anything will be the dual wield uh, Marshall 16s in Black Ops 3. I haven't actually gotten to use these so I don't know if they're as powerful, but we're going to try them. I just opened this in a supply drop, which was great. Oh, they're not as they're not as good as the Marshall 16s, but they are good nonetheless. So we're gonna run around trying to get kills with these as the Kimbo shotgun, and then we'll switch. Oh, there was a guy down here. Oh, he was over there. He was. Camping. Okay, they got him. There's a guy up there. Enemy UAV in your vicinity. Oh, he moved on me. Okay, so we're gonna ah. Try to do, try to do well in this gameplay. Yeah, these things are not as good as the the enemy launched a counter UAV as the Marshall 16s. Because with the Marshall 16s at the range I just shot, um, at the at the range I just shot that guy should have killed him in one shot. Yeah, these things are not as powerful. They could use a buff. It takes so much to get them, and you have to be really lucky to get them in a supply drop. I think they need to be buffed a little bit. Let's try it as the as the actual gun that it is. I don't think it's that good either. Oh. UAV in your vicinity. Enemies at the train station. Okay, yeah, these are not as good because they're not drone support is single fire slugs. They're energy. They look like tri blasted energy bolts. Okay, yeah. I like them. Um, they just, they need to be buffed. If it takes that long to get, takes so much to get them. Because this is the epic variant. It, it takes like 3,500 something salvage to go from the legendary to epic variant of these guns. So, they're going to need to buff this if it's going to take so long to actually be able to to get them. If people grind to get these, these things need to be borderline overpowered. They need to be one shot kill from chest up at certain ranges. Okay, and that guy's being a complete scumbag camping like that. That's how I used to play Call of Duty. I'm not gonna lie, that is how I used to play Call of Duty. Yeah, these things are not... They're good, don't get me wrong, they're good. Because they're akimbo, and a lot of akimbo stuff is really good, but... These need to be buffed. Yeah, these need to be buffed. Like I was on top of him, and that's the only way I got the the two shot kill or the one shot kill, rather. Now 
Now, I'm not saying they need to be as OP as the Marshall 16s, but come on. Now, I know that range I shouldn't have been challenging with the akimbo shotguns. But come on. Throw us a bone here, Infinity Ward. And the shotguns suck on here to begin with. Like, I've I've used a bunch of the shotguns. I'm not bring, going to bring you guys any more gameplays of the shotguns, but... But the shotguns suck. I mean... I had a friend that was just... We were just playing together, and... He was telling me... He was... He'd seen my video on the Banshee, but he was telling me the exact same things that I was saying was wrong with the Banshee, you know? And I think the, the guns are well balanced in this game. got me from behind. Ooh, that EBR. Oh, he was up there. Okay, why don't I not see him? That guy's trash. And then I go and do that. Great job, Zarus. Great job. Then again, he did kill with a claw, so. Enemy active. Throw that nade. I like the the grenades Enemy in this UAD. game. They're not OP, but they're not bad. So they're right in the middle. They're really well balanced. So hopefully. This game's actually about to end, so I'm gonna try to get one more kill with the akimbo shotguns. There we go. Aw, oh, and then I got the kill in the kill cam, but, or the defeat screen, but uh, there you guys have it. That's my type two butcher gameplay. Um, let me know what you think. Uh, leave a comment in the comment section. What's your favorite gun in Infinite Warfare with the beta? Um, and if you enjoy this video, smash that like button. And if you're new to the channel, please feel free to hit that subscribe button if you've enjoyed my content. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, I'll see y'all on the next video.